Yo, what's crack a lacking? What's snacking? I, I. So it's Meg D back again. And today I decided to make a video on my BCX run. Well, not my run, my last game in BCX, the Brawlhalla World Championship. So let me tell y'all a story. So I played in the World Championship. I was in the losers bracket, right? And I come up with a set against Java, right? So it was 2-2, right? You can see here I won game one. I lost game two, won game three, lost game four. So going into game five, like, you know, keep in mind there's big money on the line going into this game because at this point in the tournament, whoever wins this game five set is guaranteed at least $300, right? And the loser is only guaranteed 150, right? So... You know, I'm playing this game like my family's starving. Like, I want this bread. I want this win, you know. So going into this game, I am ready. This last game here. I am prepared to whoop his ass, right? And let me just show y'all what happened, you know. Alright, so let's get right into it. I'm on Jayun. He's on Bodvar. Alright. We're finna analyze this whole game. Alright. I'm... Keep in mind, like, how intense this is. Like, you know, keep in mind, just imagine you're playing for 150 bucks and it's just one game. Like, anything can happen, you know? It's Brawl Holler. Like, you can literally get gimped off stage in a second. Like, oh my. Put the sound down a bit. A bit too loud. Right, so you gotta imagine if you're playing for $150, think about truly like how passive you're about to play. Like, I don't think you understand. Like, well, it's not really that passive right here. I'm kind of just getting wrecked. <laughs> All right. Now, Java, like, obviously, he's a crazy player, like, top 12 before, like, he's top eighted in twos, you know. Good player. But I was confident, you know? I was like, I got this. Light work. Hmm. I hate watching games back in tournament because it's like, oh, I could have done this. I could have done that. But like, to be honest, like, you could always find things you could have done better, you know, if you're watching a replay. Like, obviously, like, you can't play perfect. You got to understand that. But at the same time, you should learn, you know, like, this is what I did wrong. I should have done this. I'm going to do that next time, you know. He took the first stock. He's building up. Damn it. Wow, he had a lead. This is a big lead, I'd say. Especially in like a tournament game where people are playing slower. It's kind of harder to make a comeback, I noticed. I'm looking for a kill. Recovery, not enough. That weapon throw was questionable by me. We will talk about weapon throw soon. We'll talk about that. Alright. Okay. This isn't that big of a lead. Like, I have great sword. I can bring it back. All right, see, this is where I feel like some slow game. Ooh, I could have done more there. This is where I feel like the game starts to get slow. Like, we start playing slow. That was a good punish by me. I'm weapon starving now. Mm. All right. Passive gameplay, like, how do I talk over passive gameplay? What do I say? I right, we're jumping, I right, we're dashing. Like, what do I say? Like, what? Yep, more jumping, more dashing. Okay, I see he spot dodged. I take note. Okay, he's sharking. I get punished. Hmm. 
I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have gone for that finisher. Should have just like NC. Would have hit. Hmm. Okay, I missed the read. Tried to read dodge in, he spot dodged. Look at this guy, man. Like, how do I talk over this? Oh my, and then I keep that. Okay, that was a really good punish. That was good. I won't lie. He like perfectly dodged the NSIG. Perfectly, and Sared. Like, I probably wouldn't have done that, to be honest, if I had Hammer. That was good. All right, so he has a lead, like, most of the game, I'd say. I just didn't want to get hit right here at all. I wanted to kill him without getting hit. I think I do that, actually, yeah. Okay. Wow, so I... Okay. This is... I wish I could... Wow. I'm not going to spoil what happens, but... Uh, a lot more jumping and dashing. That was a good punish. He punished my delay. Hmm. It's always hard to land against sword because like Nair and then they have like they can catch your land with like delay and stuff. He mixed up his dodges really well. Definitely. He was spot dodging, dodging away, like he was not done with it. Oh I could have converted more. It's okay, I, I actually got more. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that was bad by me. Dodged up away. Punish? He dodged. Okay. Two minutes left in this game, by the way, if you haven't realized. I know. I didn't realize while I was playing that there was two minutes left, but that's what happens, you know? Get a recovery. Ooh. Okay. He could have recovered me. I could have died right there. Ooh. I almost killed him. Hmm. Could I have confirmed here? Maybe not. I don't know. Wow, that did not kill. Okay. Saves me off stage. Takes me everything to get. He went for that. Wow, what a savage. This point, I'm like, bro, just die, bro. Just, yo, just, just chalk it, bro. Just die, bro. I win. Just die, bro. I'm trying to recover him. Oh my god, look at this gameplay. No one's hitting each other, man. Okay. He's just weapon throwing me. I could have dodged. Ooh, that almost killed me. I have nothing. I have nothing. Oh. He definitely could have killed me right here. Definitely could have killed me right there. I'm in black health too. Like, he could have done anything out of that. Okay, weapon throw off stage. Hmm. Okay, maybe could have killed me here too. Uh, I'm surprised he didn't try to like hammer recover me. He usually does that. You know, nervous. So game five, big money. This is how it is. He throws his weapon a lot here, I noticed. Which isn't bad because it would send me far off stage. Oh, that was interesting. I feel like it's so hard to edge guard hammer here. Cause like, they use jump nair last. Like what can I do? Like how do I edge guard that? Like what? <laughs> like what? Okay. So at this point, I'm not even paying attention to the time in the game. If you look at the timer right now, 10 seconds left. I was like, wait, what? Cause the, the timer guy comes in here five, four. I'm like, yo, what's happening? He sent me off stage here with two seconds left, if you know, with a hammer. And I already used a jump too. So it sent me far off stage, like, that's like basically in the blast zone, right? It's gonna take me everything to get back. And he probably would have confirmed here. 
right? Or maybe that hammer would have hit me. I don't know. Probably not. But then sudden death happens, right? So now let's get to sudden death. The the insane part of this game. You thought before it was insane? Watch this. So off the jump. TWK, why are you spawning me facing backwards? Like, who designed this fix? Please, quick, quick patch. Quick. All right, so I spawn backwards. That's the first thing I see, right? If you don't know, sudden death. Well, I didn't know this while I was playing, but I found out after. Anything kills. Anything. I thought, like, you had to, like, sometimes you could live some things. No, I tested it. You die to any weapon throw, any unarmed sidelight, anything. You die to anything in sudden death, right? I don't know this going in because who goes to sudden death and practices, right? So let's get into it. I get the weapon and a weapon spawned on my side. So I automatically have an advantage here. I'm like, okay, a dash weapon throw is going to kill. So I try it. It doesn't work. Get my great sword. He's sitting on the wall, which is smart. He told me he sat on the wall because he knew I was going to try and weapon throw him. And you can't really get hit by a weapon on the wall, right? So smart by him. He gets his weapon and spawned perfectly on him. But I can't complain. Spawn on me too. So I throw a weapon here. Keep in mind, this is about to kill. 150 bucks in the bag, right? Right? No. Great to hitbox. The weapon throw hitbox does not match the animation. Then he decides to throw his weapon back at me, right? That's about to hit me, right? Guaranteed, right? Right? Psych, psych, frame perfect dodge. Okay. So keep in mind how intense this is. Just, just imagine you're in this situation. Just uh, truly imagine it. All right, close your eyes and imagine. Then he decides to throw his weapon softly at me. Right? I'm like, oh, easy dodge, right? Easy, right? I should have dodged forward. Right? But no, that's it. I died. That's it. That's the end of the video. That's it. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. Pray for me in the comments. Peace.